What's up guys, it's Overly215 here, and today I'm going to show you three new glitches in the Destiny 2 beta. Okay guys, so I'm going to list these glitches off in the order in which you can do them. These glitches are going to range from how to get outside of the beginning mission Homecoming, how to get into the Lost Sector glitch, and an infinite super glitch. So when you start up the Destiny 2 beta, you're going to have two beginning missions. In the second half, it's going to be the Homecoming mission mission you want to get to the point in the mission where I am here and when you continue along this path now I'm gonna have to say you want to try to do this with a Titan or a warlock I wasn't able to get this to work with a hunter you want to come over to right where I am here and you want to drop off the side all the way down to this little ledge once you're on here you just want to run jump up into this section right here now you want to move forward and you're going to see this little hole. You want to jump through this and immediately look to the right and use your boost to get right on this little uh, ledge. Now from this point you can then just jump up to this metal beam and you're completely under the map guys. So this is a cool one for those people that enjoy um, exploring outside of the map and stuff like that. Moving forward you want to then start up the inverted spire strike. Now once you start up the strike you want to continue straight and then to the right over this milky looking lake now this is going to cause damage so you just want to use your jump and get over this now i'm doing this glitch as a hunter with my triple jump on you want to continue along all the way over to this area up these stairs now this is actually a sectioned off area that i don't know if it's going to be um in the game itself or if it's a future dlc i'm not sure but when you drop down where i am you just want to follow the steps that I'm doing you're gonna inch your way into this small little crack and you want to continue all the way through here now once you get to this area this is gonna be a little weird you want to pay close attention to what I'm doing because there's a lot of invisible areas and it's pretty dark I turned my brightness up as best I could but you just want to follow my movements now I'm gonna try to fast forward this here Once you get all the way to the top, from here you can actually drop down, and this is this is guaranteed to be either within the story or a DLC in the future. But as you can see, there's this huge drop down, almost looks like a portal. But yeah, guys, once again, a really cool out of the map spot that is totally, you know, not within the normal bounds of the beta. So something cool to check out and the final and third glitch I got for you guys is gonna be an infinite super glitch now it's kinda of funny because this glitch actually existed in destiny 1 and here it is back again in destiny 2 so all you wanna do is you wanna start up the inverted spire strike and you wanna stick towards the beginning you wanna stay in the beginning area where you spawn now this is gonna be completely random I gotta be honest sometimes I started up the strike and the pikes were just like right there within a minute or two and then sometimes I had to wait 10 minutes and then sometimes even longer so it's really hit or miss of when the pikes are gonna spawn in but just wait and uh, you want to explore the area a little bit this area consists of a big circle between the Milky Lake and where you spawn so you can go in a circle sometimes they're on the other side of the lake sometimes they're not uh, when you finally do get the pike you want to make sure you have your super now you want to do this, you want to make sure that you have the super equipped that has like the melee weapon. So for instance the titan it's the shield, um, the warlock it's the sword, and the hunter it's the staff. So once you have your super and the pike, ugh, man I tried to do this with a hunter. It's really hard to do with a hunter, it's actually much easier to do with a titan and I didn't try it with a warlock. But you want to stand on the side of the pike and you want to use your super. You want to give it like half a second and try to get on the pike. Once again, you're going to have to mess around with the timing. You definitely want to do it sooner rather than later. Uh, if that makes sense because if you, you, you know, if you use your super, you're going to have to play the waiting game all over again. But once you get it to work, uh, you'll know it's worked. Once you're on the pike and you have your super melee weapon... Out. Now in this instance, I have my shield while I'm on the pike. Now, you don't want to get off the pike just yet. You want to then swap out your primary, so you know, swap to something else and then put that same weapon back on. You want to do that for the first, secondary, and third weapon slots. 
Once you do that guys, BAM! There it is. Now I know I explained a lot of steps, it's really a lot simpler than, um, you know, I'm saying, I just want to be very thorough. And from that point guys, you'll have infinite super in this strike, which is pretty awesome. So, there you go guys, that is three new Destiny beta glitches. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, feel free to leave a like, and as always guys, it's Oophily215. PEACE!